Hey y'all, welcome to the uh, Christmas gift blog hop. Um, I'm only going to do this because it's kind of tricky, um, but most of this will be on my blog. Um, I'm making, I'll show you, these little angel ornaments. They're going to be for my nephews. Um, they're going to go along with his, I made a big, ooh, gotta move this, a big one for their mom to celebrate their brother, who is an angel. Um, he was still born this past August. Wow, that sounded really weird, August. So what I'm doing is I've got, now with the big one, I pieced it together with all kinds of different beads. But these I found at Michael's, they're from the bead gallery. We've got these little tiny ones, and then there's a set of bigger ones here. And they're, uh, both of them are from the bead gallery. And I've just got one strung. I took a tiny little bead from my stash to hold it together. I I put it on the the bead string elastic and then I knot it and then I string both strings both sides through so you want the the little tiny bead in the middle of your string so then I beaded all the pieces back together and so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna separate my two pieces here and I'm gonna take the top and you see the little hole on the top for the hanger piece you're going to thread one side through each. And then what I do, and you'll have to kind of give me a little bit of leeway here because I'm, I've got the camera in front of me this time, is I just go ahead and thread it back through the opposite um, hole and bring it back to the bottom. And I do that because, A, I have a really hard time knotting them and getting them to say. So this is just a little extra security. And B, so you don't see it. And you kind of have to wiggle it and see how far. And I'm going to have to use my tweezers to get this back out. Which is not that big of a deal, but... Okay, come on. I got you to come out earlier. There we go. Okay. So I know I needed to pull these up just a little bit more. So I did too much. Okay, so then what you're going to do is you've got to kind of let your angel piece hang down. Okay. Oops, I dropped it there. Sorry. So now what you're going to do is you're going to tip it over and you're going to find your two ends. And I knot them. And I try and I double knot them and I try to pull it as tight as possible. Now, um, I saw a tutorial on um, Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep's Facebook page. Um, and the co founder was making them for her son. And I thought, hey, those are cute. I'm a crafter. I can do that. Except I don't know what kind of beading wire she was using, or sorry, not wire. But she was melting them, and every time I try to melt this to stay together, it melts too much, and it ends up coming apart. So, and I don't think I got that tight enough, but it might just be that way. So that's what I do to attach my angel to the top so it hangs. So if you want to see the rest of this ornament, head over to my blog. Um, I will put the link in the information bar below. Thanks for stopping by.